Right now, hundreds of health care workers are voting whether or not they're willing to strike over stalled contract negotiations. Workers with SEIU Healthcare Minnesota have not been able to agree on a new contract with health partners. The main sticking point involves changes to their health care plans. Kay Raddatz spoke to the workers about why they feel the cause is worth fighting for. More than 1,800 health care workers will cast their vote Thursday, deciding if they are willing to strike over failed contract negotiations with health partners. We have a lot of strong support from our members, and we are hoping to get that strike vote, and we are hoping that the employer will see that we all we want to do is negotiate and collaboratively with them and bring them back to the table. They're upset over proposed changes to health benefits. SEIU Healthcare Minnesota claims Health Partners wants to raise co pays and premiums. Clara Boykin is a lab technician and has worked in her field for decades. I feel we deserve the best health care if we work for the best health care company itself. So therefore, I did not feel it was they were justified in doing this to us. WCCO reached out to health partners. They released a statement saying in part, we proposed modest changes to their health plan that would support better health and encourage our colleagues to get care in high quality, more affordable settings. We believe that this is a fair and reasonable proposal, especially given the financial headwinds facing the health care industry. The union health care workers from 30 different clinics across the Twin Cities will continue to work under the language of their expired contract for now. Okay. The health care workers have until 9 o'clock tonight to cast their votes. Members of the SEIU Healthcare Minnesota told me that they are prepared to go on strike but are hoping to avoid that if both parties can come to the table and reach an agreement. Reporting in St. Paul, Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. Results of the vote will be announced tomorrow morning and depending on the results, the workers could authorize a strike in 10 days.